I don't know how to code, but I'm gonna build an app. AI can be a game changer for your social media marketing. Here are a few ways. And this app uses ChatGPT's advanced voice mode to act as a consultant for a business 24 seven. I'm gonna be using Bolt.new, which is a platform that allows you to use AI to build software in minutes, even if you don't know how to code like me. Along with that, I'm gonna be using Synthflow to build our custom AI voice assistant, which allows us to very simply use the new ChatGPT advanced voice mode. So with that being said, let's get right into it. So I'm inside of Bolt.new and this is where we're gonna build our web application with natural language in minutes. I wrote in a prompt and basically said, build me a basic user interface in order to speak with a voice widget of OpenAI's advanced voice mode. Let me embed HTML code for the widget. Then I basically explained that I want to make a site for an AI consulting company called AI Accelerator. Add the ability to add notes for the user to add when speaking with the assistant. This way they can get direct consulting and save notes on each consulting session. And I basically said, make the user interface look very sleek and modern. Now on the right hand side, you could actually see Bolt.new writing the code for us using the natural language that we gave it takes that information and then starts coding based on the prompt we give it. It took about a minute and it spit out this awesome user interface for our web application. The widget's actually getting an error, but that's because it only works when the site is deployed. And I'll show you that in a bit. Now that we have the initial prototype of the app built with Bolt.new, we are inside of Synthflow and we want to come to assistance and come to configure. What we want to do is we want to then give our assistant a name. We want to call this AI consultant. And then for AI voice, click real time voice mode. Next up, we need to go to the prompt. This is where we're going to configure our AI voice assistant to act and function exactly how we need it to. So we're going to set this thing up to actually act as an AI consultant and consult different businesses on how they could implement AI. And then it'll obviously be embedded on that web application that we built in minutes with bolt.new. One of the really cool features inside of Synthflow here is we actually, we could actually go to ask copilot and this actually uses an AI prompt assistant to help you craft the perfect prompt for your AI to actually utilize. So we don't, we don't need to be a prompt engineer here. We could just use our language and try to explain what we're trying to build. And it will actually help us perfect that prompt. So our AI assistant functions properly. I don't need to show you exactly how I prompted this thing, but right here, I'm actually telling it to use the knowledge base that I'm going to upload to pull information from in order to consult these users based on the information that is provided in the knowledge base. So we could upload documents or text files, all that stuff with any information that we want our AI trained on. And that's what I'm telling it to do now. Once we have all the information in our prompt, we could actually insert the prompt and there we go. Our AI will use this in order to function. All right, so on the left-hand side, I wanna come over to actions. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a new information extractor. So what this does is this allows us to pull information on the call with the AI. So I'm going to pull the name of the user and I'm also gonna pull the email. So fill out the identifier for the name and then what the AI should extract from the call. Um, we wanna basically say, what is the name of the user? That is what we're trying to pull and add a quick example there so it knows what kind of an example text is there. Now I'm gonna do the exact same thing, but for email, I already set up this email extractor. So it's gonna extract the name and the email so that way we have information on this user who's interacting with our AI. I'm back in the prompt section. I just need to change the custom greeting. So it's going to say, hey, this is Samantha, your AI consultant, how could I help you? Moving on, the last thing we need to configure inside of our AI voice assistant is our knowledge base. So come over to the left-hand side, click knowledge base, and then add a name for this specific knowledge base. I'm gonna call this AI consulting documentation. And what this is gonna be is this is basically the brain behind our AI assistant. So all think of all the information that you need this trained on, whether this is training manuals or documents or frequently asked questions for your business. All this stuff, I'm actually going to upload on a text document you could upload either a PDF, a text document, all of these different things, or even a URL of a website. Uh, make sure to name it and then add the content there so it has access to all of this knowledge. Lastly, we need to come over to our widget, copy this embed code down here, and we will import this into our bolt.new site. Here is the live application. Let's go ahead and test this out. Hey, this is Samantha, your AI consultant. How can I help you? Yeah, so I wanna ask some questions on how AI could actually help my business. Fantastic. Before we dive in, could I get your name and email address to keep in touch and send you any relevant information after our chat? Yeah, sure. My name is Brock Messerich and my last, my email is actually brockmesserich at gmail.com. Great. Thanks, Brock. So what specific areas of your business are you interested in improving with AI? 
Are you looking to optimize operations, enhance customer experience, or maybe something else? Honestly, that's why I wanted to talk to you because I have no clue what AI could do and where the use cases are in my business. All I know is I no want to save, all I know is I want to save more time, honestly. Saving time is a great goal. AI can help streamline various business processes. For example, AI can automate repetitive tasks, manage customer inquiries through chatbots, or even analyze data to provide insights for better decisions. Actually, I've got a question. So I spend a lot of time on marketing and making uh, videos for like social media. How could I use AI to help in that process? AI can be a game changer for your social media marketing. Here are a few ways. Content creation. AI tools can help generate ideas for posts, write captions, and even create videos or graphics. This can save you a lot of time brainstorming and designing content. Personalization. AI can analyze your audience's preferences and behaviors, helping you create more personalized and engaging content that resonates with your followers. Three, scheduling and posting. AI-driven tools can determine the best times to post for maximum engagement and can automate the posting process. You're welcome. If you have any more questions or want to explore these ideas further, feel free to reach Thank out. Thank you so much. That was actually really helpful. You're welcome, Brock. I'm glad I could help. If you have more questions or want to explore these ideas further, feel free to reach out. Have a great day. Thank you. All right, there we have it. We built and deployed our own application that acts as a consulting session, along with the ability to take notes within the dashboard we created. We built all of this with no coding experience at all. And using Synflow, we connected ChatGPT's advanced voice mode with our assistant to make it sound just like a human. Along with that, we added custom actions to extract information during the consulting sessions. This whole process took about 15 minutes with all things considered. I really hope you could understand the impact this could have on businesses. Imagine having this thing running 24 seven and charging by the minute for consulting sessions. That's just one idea of how we could monetize this. There are so many more options and ways we could use this to provide value to our customers or to our leads on our website, for example. So if you guys wanna replicate this exact process I use, make sure to sign up with Bolt.new and sign up with Synflow. Synflow makes it extremely easy to access a ChatGPT advanced voice mode without having to figure out the API connections yourself. So make sure to sign up. There is a link for both of those below. If you want to join a school community with AI for non-technical people, make sure to join that as well. I have that in the description. I'm not a technical person. I'm not a coder, but I'm building really cool applications with zero coding just by using natural language. So if that sounds good to you, make sure to join that as well as subscribe to the YouTube channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.